Ayata is pleased to introduce the 12th edition of the Airport Development Reference Manual, the result of a global collaboration involving airport architects, planners, and operators. Let us now share with you some of what's new in the ADRM. Today, environmental sustainability is a top priority. The ADRM recognizes this with a new dedicated chapter. It highlights best practices and recommendations to help airports design infrastructure that achieves their environmental objectives both today and in the future. On the topic of peak hour planning and following months of extensive research and data analysis, we have changed our recommended uh, definition on how to select peak hour. In addition, we have also significantly expanded the section on how to forecast those peaks into the future, how to form robust design day flash schedules, and last but not least, we have proposed an alternative methodology for our capacity calculations. The ADRM now includes insights on how the COVID-19 pandemic is still affecting important aspects of the airport planning journey, such as traffic forecasting, master planning, terminal capacity, and of course, the level of service. It also includes a brand new section on pandemic resilience and healthy buildings that will make sure that any future pandemic can be easily handled. We have included a rewritten section that focuses on airport accessibility and how universal design can help us plan airports that are usable by all passengers, including people with disabilities, without the need for adaptation. The ADRM also covers the often overlooked but critically important topic of how to plan for efficient and smooth construction delivery phase. Finally, it's important to understand how facilities will be used and operated. We've added a section on concept of operations. This will help planners identify outcomes and how they will be met. It also covers irregular operations and how to determine what is needed to ensure airport resilience.